What size bag and board do you need? Hi friends, Rick from BCW Supplies, and today I'm going to go over the many different options that BCW Supplies has to offer when it comes to your comic bag and board needs. While today's comic books are normally 6 and 5 8 inch by 10 and 3 16 inch, these dimensions were not always standardized. Throughout the history of comic books, publishers have made comics in different sizes. BCW has simplified the comic book sizes into three groups or ages. Current comic books, the most common, being released from 1970 to present day. Silver Age comics were printed from 1956 to 1969, and those comics were larger than the current comics. Golden Age comics were published between 1938 and 1955, and they were even larger still. If you know what age your comic falls in, then you know where to start. However, if you're unsure, please measure the dimensions of your comic with the ruler and compare those sizes with the options at your local comic shop or listed at bcwsupplies.com. For each age, BCW offers four different polypropylene bag options. Polypropylene is an acid-free, archival-safe material that is great for long-term storage of comics. First, we have the normal version, which is perfect for standard comics of that age group. And it has a one-inch flap that you can seal with tape. The second version we offer are bags for thick comics. If your comic has more pages than a normal issue, like an annual or double issue, then this is the bag option for you. In this instance, the word Thick refers to the depth of the comic and not the thickness of the polypropylene. The third version has the convenience of a resealable strip to close the bag. The resealable strip is on the bag and not on the flap. This is to help prevent the comic from coming into contact with the adhesive. Nonetheless, we do suggest that you insert your comic into the bag before removing the resealable strip cover. The fourth option is a combination for the thicker comics and offers the convenience of a resealable strip. Some comic collectors prefer mylar bags over polypropylene. The benefit of the polypropylene bags are that it's more flexible than mylar and it's easier to fold and close the top. The polypropylene bags are also the most economical. In contrast, the mylar bags are more rigid and crystal clear. BCW mylar bags are named archivals and are available in a 2 mil or 4 mil thick mylar. It is common for collectors to use archivals for their key issues, special variants, or autographed comics, while the rest of their collection is stored safely in polypropylene bags. Before we look at the backing board sizes offered by BCW Supplies, let's discuss the purpose of these boards. Backing boards serve three functions. The first, the boards help protect the edges of your comics. Second, the boards provide rigidity to prevent the comic book spine from bending or creasing. The BCW backing boards are 24 points thick to help keep them rigid. The third function is to absorb some of the acid that is present in comic book paper and inks. BCW backing boards have a calcium carbonate coating to absorb some of these acids to keep your comics in great condition for longer. We recommend changing your backing boards every three to five years as the acid from the comic will neutralize the calcium carbonate in the backing board. When inserting your comic and board into a comic bag, we suggest facing the glossy side of the backing board towards the back of the comic book. With that covered, let us look at the backing board sizes. BCW has two backing board sizes that fit inside the modern, current comic bags. The current backing board fills the bag, leaving a small amount of the backing board visible on the sides of the comic. The modern backing board is the same width as the comic, cutting down on the visibility of the backing board. Both backing boards will work with the modern or current comic bags and is symbolized by the blue box on the packaging. There are also two sizes of backing boards that fit the regular silver bags. The Silver Age backing board will fill the bag, providing that 1 8 inch extra board around the comic. 
the regular board are the same dimensions as the Silver Age comics. To get the correct bag for your silver or regular boards, get the regular or silver bags marked with the light purple color box on the top of the packaging. And last, when it comes to the Golden Age, BCW has one backing board option to pair with the different Golden Age bag options. These items are marked with the yellow color box on the packaging. Thank you for watching this brief video. I hope this answered your question about the bag and backing board sizes that you need for your comics. If you have more questions or would like more information regarding this topic, please click the link in the description.